Takedown Tribe, it is Takedown Tuesday, and we felt like it was finally time to give you guys that ice cream challenge you have been asking for. Woo! You guys have been patient with this one, but probably patiently awaiting a Ben & Jerry's challenge, but we had our first taste of Talenti just a few weeks back. Wow, that's really good. And loved it so much that we decided to challenge ourselves over 24 pints of their delicious gelato for our first ever massive ice cream challenge. Now, not only is that a lot of calories and a lot of the dreaded lactose, but it's also 12 flavors that we've never tried before. So this should be quite interesting. Yeah, and we also have the biggest food challenge we've ever done coming out within the next couple weeks. So I'm thinking that today we just kick back, hang out, and enjoy this challenge until we no longer can. All right, let's take down some Talenti. All right. So one of our most highly anticipated flavors is this confetti cookie. Let's start with that. Let's do it. Ooh, this thing looks so good. Let's read it. This has got five layers. It's got vanilla gelato, vanilla cookies, pink frosting, another layer of vanilla gelato, and rainbow sprinkles. Sounds right up our alley. Put frosting in it, we're good. Yeah. You could probably put frosting and sprinkles on like a hot dog and I'd like it. <laughs> All right, take a look at this. How good does that look? I'm actually gonna take this down in case the camera decides to autofocus on it the entire video. All right, ready to try this? Let's get into it, okay? Oh my God. Yeah. That's the smoothest ice cream I've ever had. Wow. Let me show them this. It is not okay that that is as good as it, as good as it is. Wow! I think it's gonna be hard to beat that. That was incredible. It was like a birthday cake inside of a pint of ice cream. Phenomenal. By the way, we are going to call this gelato ice cream this entire video. It's just gonna happen, so anticipate that. Yeah. yeah, same thing in my opinion. I think I think that, I think gelato just is like the Italian word for ice cream. I could be wrong. But anyways, let's do this pretzel one, all right? Okay, let's, let's read this off again. It's got five layers, just like the other one, which is a salted pretzel gelato, chocolatey waffle cone pieces, salted pretzel sauce, vanilla gelato, and chocolate flakes. We are big fans of chocolate-covered pretzels, so I am excited. Okay, let's see how this is. Oh, mine's got a, mine's got a thing on top. Mine doesn't have one. Okay, take a look at this one. See how it is, give it a go. Whoa, wow, yup. Wow. That pretzel sauce? What the heck is that? Let's take it down. That is phenomenal, I am in heaven. That is the perfect amount of salt coming through. Yeah. Let me show them this before. That might be my favorite pint of ice cream ever. It's going to be very hard to beat that. <laughs> the texture from those chocolatey waffle cone pieces. I don't I don't know what the best part of that was. Like pretzel flavored gelato and the pretzel sauce. Everything about that was perfect. We gotta keep moving though, cause it's a lot of ice cream. Yeah. Um, next up, are we doing Southern butter pecan? Yeah. We love butter pecan ice cream, always have. So I'm looking forward to this, like all of them, I guess. <clears throat> okay, let's read this one. This has got creamy buttery gelato with roasted pecans and swirls of our signature dulce de leche. It's got dulce de leche in it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I never thought of putting caramel or dulce de leche in butter pecan ice cream. That sounds unbelievable. I am excited to try that. All of the ice cream is already melting, by the way. <laughs> yeah, one of the reasons why we've been avoiding this challenge. <laughs> 
They can't all be this good. I, I have no words for that. Amazing. Let's, let's just take it down. I just hit all the pecans. <clears throat> that is so good. It's so buttery. I think I'm getting my first brain freeze of the day as well. But wow, yeah, that's the most buttery ice cream I have ever tried. Yeah. Ooh, got my brain freeze now. <laughs> Like 90% of the Dulce de Leche was at the bottom of this. <laughs> I'm no complaints though, that was okay. great. Not complaining about that. This is going too well so far though. And actually, I think we should make mention of the fact that this is actually like the perfect, the perfect temperature, the perfect texture of meltiness. Mm. Because like the outside of it is all like super melted and really creamy, but then the center is still frozen. So it's actually really nice. And you're able to detect the flavors a little bit more that way. Yeah. So it actually works out. Mm -hmm. But let's keep moving. Yes. What do we want to do next? What do we have up here? Salted caramel truffle and coffee cookie crumble. Let's do the coffee because we just had caramel. Okay. Caramel, caramel, pecans, pecans. Let's just get that one out of the way as well. <laughs> We're probably gonna mention that every single time we have either of those ingredients in any challenge. Okay, let's read this off. It's hard to read. Uh, what's that top one say? Cold brew gelato. Cold brew gelato, dark chocolate chunks, chocolate coffee sauce, vanilla bean gelato, and amaretti cookie pieces. These things are amazing. We love mix-ins, and so this is perfect for us. Take a look at this. All right, let's do it. Whoa, that is a lot of coffee. That's beautiful. That's like super sophisticated tasting. I need to get further down. Another hit. Wouldn't you know it? The only, the flavor that we had had in that other video was the coffee chip. This one, far superior. Yeah, this takes it. Yeah. Let's crush it. bottle that coffee sauce holy cow that was unbelievable <clears throat> the people over at Talenti are wizards <laughs> this is absolutely amazing the cookie pieces at the bottom of that were soaking up all of the gelato and made it feel like there was cookie dough at the bottom of that one yeah it kind of tasted like that it's, it's like literally like packaging up like an ice cream sundae into a pint of ice cream. I am absolutely loving this. Yeah. By the way, this is not supposed to be a product review. <laughs> this is supposed to be a food challenge. But if you love mix-ins, you need to get on this Talenti Layers game. Yeah. Anyways, let's keep moving. <laughs> what, what do we have now? We've got salted caramel truffle. <laughs> this really did just become a product review video. <laughs> I love how they decided to put lids or this like seal on some of them and not others. I wonder what the logic there is. Okay, this is the five layers of this one. Sea salt caramel gelato, chocolate cookies, dulce de leche. Oh, more dulce de leche. I'm, I'm okay with that. Vanilla gelato and caramel truffles. We love salt and dessert, so let's see how this is. That got a high five. Yeah. Maybe number one of the day. Wow. Whoa. I don't know. It's between this one and pretzel so far. Ooh.
was the perfect amount of absolutely everything. The perfect amount of texture from the cookies and then the candy or like the uh, the truffles in the bottom. Perfect amount of cream from the ice cream and then like the stickiness of the dulce de leche. Wow. It literally is phenomenal. And the perfect amount of salt to sweet. Nothing's gonna beat that. The chocolate covered truffles at the bottom, the caramel truffles. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, those are amazing. <clears throat> what do you want to do next? Because I'm starting to notice signs of what people explain to be the real issue with ice cream challenges being a cold mass that doesn't seem to move. Yeah. That's starting to accumulate right here. Yeah. And my core temperature is starting to shift a little. Yeah, and we're, it's, we've still got a long way to go. Yeah. What do we have here on this layer? Got peanut butter, vanilla fudge, mm -hmm. strawberry shortcake, and caramel apple pie. Maybe <clears throat> let's do caramel apple pie and then strawberry shortcake. Oh, cool. Caramel apple pie. What's this one got? This is a. This is pieces of apple, pieces of apple and flaky pie crust blended into cinnamon gelato with a swirl of dulce de leche. That's a lot of dulce de leche going on in this video. Yeah. <laughs> You'd also think that we read these descriptions before buying them, but I didn't know that that had cinnamon gelato. Whoa. Okay. All right. I'll take a look at this. Let's go. Oh, that's really nice. Mm. You put ice cream on apple pie. This is like the opposite. <laughs> this is so good, yeah. wow. Mm. Brain freeze. <laughs> oh. I got a bad one, huh? Oh yeah, that's a real one. <laughs> that's not that's not one that I would typically spring for, but that was that was awesome. It was the perfect amount of cinnamon. <clears throat> I've never had anything like it in my life. That was spectacular. If you like apple pie or you just love like fall flavors. You gotta get that one. Yeah. Phenomenal. But I guess we've said that about every plant so far. I've gotta stop saying it. Well, one that is actually questionable, well, there's two on here that are questionable because we don't really love the fruity ice creams or gelatos. True. So strawberry shortcake sounds fantastic because strawberry shortcake is fantastic, but we'll see how it is in gelato form. All right, let's try it. Here are these five layers. We've got strawberry gelato, shortbread pieces, Strawberry rhubarb sauce, uh, another layer of strawberry gelato, and another layer of shortbread pieces. I'm getting cold. Yeah. Ugh. My core temperature has <clears throat> plummeted. So this is about where you're gonna see it start getting a little miserable. The vibe is about to change, I have a feeling. It looks beautiful. Gorgeous, as sna our friend a Snack Murder would say. Mm hmm. Okie dokie. Let's try it. It's good. For what it is, it's good. Yeah, but it's not my thing. Mm hmm. No, I wouldn't get it again. Mm hmm. But it is nice. That's a lot of shortbread. <laughs> I would never get it again. But if you do like strawberry ice cream, I would probably recommend it. Yeah. <clears throat> I love the shortbread pieces 
with the strawberry rhubarb sauce, though. Hmm. I did enjoy that. It did break things up as well, because things <clears> are... <throat> Most of these are very rich, mm -hmm. so that did help break it up. And also, you just n mentioned Snack Murder, which is a friend of ours over on Instagram. He does food reviews. Make sure to check him out and tell him that the Michelle Twins or the Takedown Twins, whatever you'd like to call us, sent you over there. He's a really awesome dude, and he loves Talenti. And he's the, probably the only person that is more excited to see Talenti than Ben and Jerry's on this table. <laughs> yeah, probably. But one sec, I think I have a hand warmer down here, and I'm going to need that because... My core temperature has plummeted, and I'm getting very uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yeah, warm up my hands oh, for a yeah. sec. That's a good idea. I was smart and brought that hand warmer. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Mine's not that warm. Yeah. Mine's, mine's kind of. You want to try this? All right. Next up, we've got the peanut butter vanilla fudge. That one's pretty warm, right? Mm-hmm. All right. Peanut butter vanilla fudge. These five layers are peanut butter gelato, peanut butter cups, Fudge sauce, vanilla gelato, and peanut butter cookies. And we not we might not be crazy about strawberry ice cream, but we are crazy about pretty much anything peanut butter. Yeah. Uh oh. Okay. I'll show you guys this one. Down she goes. That's a that's an appropriate amount of peanut butter. That is perfect. Fudge on the bottom there. Mm -hmm. I think the best part about this one was the fact that the peanut butter cookies on the bottom were soaking up all of the melting, all of like the melting gelato and the fudge sauce. Excellent, right up our alley. Yeah. <clears throat> That was an excellent peanut butter ice cream. Man, people say that ice cream challenges are a unique beast and just a completely different type of challenge. And I am realizing why they say that. Yeah, it's very uncomfortable. You've never had this type of sensation. I mean, this is like, I don't think we mentioned yet, but this is like 20 pounds worth of gelato or worth of ice cream. It's, it's 10 pounds each. And so that, might, that means how much do we have in us? Like six pounds so far each? Something like that. Something like that. And I'm feeling it. <clears throat> yeah. We've eaten way more calories than this in a single sitting. Yeah. But, yeah, I'm just feeling it in a completely different way. Just like, a different type of discomfort. That's yeah. for sure. It's not leaving this area. Right here. <laughs> so, so weird. All right, we've got to keep moving, though, because, yeah, yeah it's, starting to get, it's starting to get tough. What do we have here on the bottom row? Mm. Vanilla peanut butter swirl. We just had peanut butter. And we got vanilla fudge something. Caramel cookie crunch and black raspberry vanilla parfait. I'm gonna skip the parfait <clears throat> for now. I think so. Do you want to try to get the caramel down or the this other layers? What do you think? Caramel. Caramel. All right. What's this one got? This is a slow cooked sweet cream gelato with chocolate cookie crumbles and ribbons of dulce de leche. We have had a lot of dulce de leche today. I guess so. <laughs> I think this is the last thing you're going to know. Oh, there it is. Caramel Cookie Crunch. I think that this is like their top selling flavor or their most popular flavor. Mm -hmm. So let's see how it is. See if we agree with the masses. I like the layers more, but it is quite good. Mm -hmm.
I don't know about yours, but all the caramel was on the bottom of that. Yep. <laughs> so it's just like eating straight caramel by the bottom. <clears throat> How are you feeling right now? I am feeling like a dozen pints of gelato may have been too ambitious. Uh, yeah. If it was 10, I'd be like, okay, this was great. I'm full. I'm a little uncomfortable, but it'll be all right. A dozen, it's seeming like a lot. Yeah, taking down one more definitely feels like, oh yeah, that would have been the right amount. <laughs> but hey, it's a food challenge. Meets product review, I guess. <clears throat> so, what's up next? <clears throat> we're gonna do the layers or we wanna do the peanut butter? I do one of these layers. Okay, let's do the layers. Um, I'm thinking we got the vanilla and we've got the black raspberry. I'm thinking the vanilla. All right, okay. This one is vanilla fudge cookie. Let's see if I can read this. It's dark chocolate gelato, chocolate cookies, fudge sauce, vanilla bean gelato, and broken waffle cone. <sighs> Sounds a bit rich for right now. I know. <clears throat> but I just not feeling the parfait. Oh, okay. Here's the next one. The vibe in here has changed. Oh yeah, I'm, uh, I'm having a difficult time now. Yeah. It's just, if it would just get a little bit further than the very top of my stomach, I'd be all right. <clears throat> okay. That's a little too rich for right now. Mm -hmm. mm. That might be the creamiest one yet though. Wow. The pints are taking a lot longer to eat at this point. Mm -hmm. That's 10 each. We're 20 deep. I'd like to be done now. Man, it's because I have to burp so badly. I know. And it won't come out. I wonder if it's the lactose, if it's the cold, or if it's just the sheer weight, amount of weight and sugar that we've eaten. I don't know what it is, but I'm feeling, there it is, a little bit. I feel oh. like it's gotta be the lactose, mm. because like I've said, we've done more weight, more sugar, more calories, but God, yeah. what is this sensation? I don't know. We've got two flavors left. Which one do you want to tackle? Neither, I know, but. Um, I am determined to at least try both, no matter what. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna give this fruity one a shot, I think. Okay. Let, let's, let's try them both. Okay. okay. See which one is feasible. Okay, this, this is a black raspberry vanilla parfait. The five layers are black raspberry gelato, oat crisps, blueberry sauce, vanilla gelato, and another layer of oat crisps. The oat crisps sound nice. The rest, meh. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. Big surprise though. We've both eaten 10 pints of gelato and we feel unwell. Nobody is surprised here. Okay. This is the layers. All right. Let me give this a shot. Black raspberry. That one's okay. Yeah, not bad.
We got a lot of comments on our 30,000 calories in 30 minutes video saying how miserable I looked <laughs> throughout that challenge. I imagine we'll be getting similar comments as for how I look right now. Oh, I'm struggling. Yeah. I don't think this whole thing's going down. Oh. Excuse me. I can't get it. Oh. Oh, I can't sit up straight. Oh. Uh, I feel generally awful. I think that this sensation of doing this much gelato or ice cream could only be understood by someone who's attempted this. Yeah. I never quite understood when I saw other people saying how it's very uncomfortable. And now I understand. Yeah. Uh, I've seen Eric the Electric say it. I've seen Jeff Esper say it. <coughs> Matt Stoney say it. Like, I've seen everybody say it. They talk about this like cold mass and your core temperature being low and just like, it's a different type of unwell feeling compared to any other food challenge we've done. Yes. Oh. With that being said, are we gonna do taste this? See if we can, I just don't think it's gonna be possible for me to get the whole thing down. Yeah. But here, we'll give it a shot. This is, it's a vanilla gelato with a creamy roasted peanut butter swirl and mini peanut butter cups. <clears throat> Normally, that would be a dream. In this current moment, it feels horrifying. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I gotta calm down. Okay. I'm gonna be honest. I am teetering. Yeah. I am teetering. I think it's the lactose, but <clears throat> it's gotta be. Okay. I'm gonna give it a chance. But if I think that I'm going to throw up, I will have to throw the towel. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, okay let's try it. At any other point in time, this would be fantastic. You're crushing. We're so close. No, it feels so far. I still got a little ways to go. Hmm. Oh, so close. So close. You are right there. You're gonna do it. You got it. Oh. oh, good job. All right. We're gonna have to make this short and sweet because I'm so cold. I need a sweatshirt and a hot shower very badly. Oh. And then curl up into the fe fetal position because I feel incredibly unwell. Oh. Ooh. My favorite flavors of the day were the salted caramel, uh, no, yeah, the salted caramel truffle and the pretzel, the chocolate pretzel. That's all I can about, that's all, about all I can say right now because my head is so far up my you-know-what. <coughs> but man, <coughs> Talenti does rule. It's really good. I can't believe that's a win. Oh, I thought for sure at 10 points, 10 points, 10 pints, that that was gonna be a fail. Yeah. But wow. 
fought hard for that. Yeah. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you have been one of the many people to request ice cream, hopefully this gelato did it for you. Give the video a like, jump in the comment section, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you again next Takedown Tuesday. Oh, oh. God, I feel awful. Oh, I feel awful. Absolutely terrible. Oh, good job, good job.